Hello everyone. Today we will understand how to multiply mixed fractions. At the end of the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe and leave a comment in the comment section. Now, first of all, we have to convert these mixed fractions into improper fractions. And for that, we will write down here 1, 1 by 2 is equals to. Now, 2 into 1 is equals to 2. Then we have to add this 2 to the numerator, which is 1. So 2 plus 1 is equals to 3. We'll write down this 3 here and the denominator. Then 3, 5 by 6. We'll do the same. We will multiply 6 with 3. We will get it equals to 18. Then we'll do 18 plus 5, which is equals to 23. We'll write down 23 by 6. Now we will write down here 3 by 2 into 23 by 6. So in this case, we can multiply numerator with numerator and we can multiply denominator with denominator. So we'll do that. 3 into 23 is 69. 2 into 6 is 12. Then we have to simplify it. Divided by 3, divided by 3 and we'll get it equals to 23 over 4. Now we have to change it into mixed fraction because we started with the mixed fraction. So the answer also should be in the mixed fraction. So we'll divide 23 with 4. So let's divide 23 divided by 4. 4 fives are 20 and we'll get here 3. So this is divisor. This is quotient and this one is remainder. So how we can write it as? We can write down here divisor. We can write down here quotient and remainder. So divisor is 4, quotient is 5 and the remainder is 3. So the answer for this question is 5, 3 by 4. Similarly, in this question, we will first convert the mixed fraction into improper fraction. So 12 into 1 is equals to 12 and 12 plus 8 is equals to 20. So 20 over 12. We'll write down here 20 over 12 into similarly we'll solve for 3 2 by 10 10 into 3 is equals to 30 and 30 plus 2 is equals to 32 over 10 we'll write down that 32 over 10 now after that we will multiply numerator with numerator denominator with denominator if I will multiply 20 with 32, I will get 640. And if I will multiply 12 with 10, I will get 120. Now we have to simplify our answer. We'll divide it with 10. We divide it with 10. We'll get equals to 64 over 12. Then we will divide it with number 4. Here also we'll divide it with number 4. We will get equals to 16 over 3. Now, after that, we have to convert it into mixed fraction. So 16 over 3 can be written as 16 divided by 3, divided by 3. So 3 fives are 15. We'll get 1 as a remainder. So this is remainder, quotient, divisor. We'll write down divisor, quotient, remainder. In place of divisor, we will write down 3. In place of quotient, we'll write down 5. And in place of remainder, we'll write down 1. So this is how we can multiply the mixed fraction.